I feel like it's going to be worse. It might be. I think for you, yes. Is this a bug? I don't want to eat a bug. No! Crickets. No! Ugh. Sour cream and onion. I don't want to do this. Welcome back to another episode of Just One Fern. Luke's not here to do a whole lot of talk about a whole lot of nothing. And we have officially hit 1,000 subscribers. What, what? Let's go. Finally. Thank you so much. Thank you. This is the best. Now I'm now I'm going to give Aaron the funnel this weekend. What, what is that? You don't remember? The funnel? We agreed. What did we agree on? He was asleep when we agreed. I thought we agreed that we'd buy a cat together. But that was, a, that <laughs> we was did. all it's, that I remember. It's too late now. It's, it's too, too late. late now. Had we had we done it in December, I would have done it. I would have <laughs> yeah. said yes. Yeah, yeah. It's too late now. <laughs> um, I think what you should if, still get a cat. Maybe eventually, depending on what happens. Fernie. I'm not gonna call my cat, <laughs> I'm not gonna call my cat Fernie. <laughs> but we did, we did it. We did it. We yeah. did. We did. We hit it. We thanks hit to it, viewers and we hit it like hard. you. Yes. PBS. PBS. Um, thank you all for subscribing. It means a lot to us. And now we're like so close to actually being able to make some cash from this, which would be fantastic. We just mm-hmm. need everyone to watch every episode in its full entirety. On multiple browsers. Multiple on multi- browsers. On multiple I think devices. I'm gonna start streaming multiple times a day. Just throw it on? Yeah. Do it. Because it's gonna it will stream to the shorts feed now sometimes if it's oh, like if you do it nice. through the phone. Uh, can you do like just you eating cereal? Yeah. I would watch that. If yeah. I if I was scrolling, I saw somebody just eating cereal, I'm in. Yeah. I would even do like just work from home with me and it's just me at my desk, like soft, <laughs> not doing anything. Um but yeah, we we just need to get our watch hours up and then we'll start making some cashola from this, which will be huge. Which means, you know, we just you know keep moving forward, onward and upward. And then that's all that matters. What is this? What is this funnel? You're gonna funnel me? No, we're gonna funnel you. Make a funnel cake? No. Did you know that funnel cakes are called funnel cakes because the batter goes through a funnel into the fryer? Really? Yeah. I had no just idea. Just heard just found that out. <laughs> the the brilliance you know. of TikTok. That's crazy. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. We hit 1,000 subscribers. Don't we get like a like a wooden play button or something? A Shit. wooden play button? Like a, from like made YouTube? of sticks? Like a leaf play button? <laughs> like the people who get plaques for 100 Yeah, yeah, yeah. They get the yeah, plaques. We get a, Our, ours is we made get a out twig. Of, a twig. Ours is made out of shit. <laughs> Actual feces. But like they, they get someone epoxy. with a million subs to take a shit and they send it to us. <laughs> and they say, hey, here's this. Yeah, this is Mr. Beast's shit. Yeah. <laughs> no, actually, no. You guys. And then I, I think it. Five thousand, you get his piss. You get a piss. You get a piss. And when you move it, it like like the you can see it like swish around, right? Because it's <laughs> yeah, clear, right? It becomes like a science project. Really, it's like something um, you take care of, like a plant almost. Can we make a fake play button to put behind us? <laughs> yeah, we could. One thousand. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> That's hilarious. actually really funny. Yeah, <laughs> I, I put in our bio one k on YouTube, and I felt disgusting doing it. I was like. <sighs> Why? Because <laughs> it's just funny. Like, because I see a lot of people they'll put like, oh, like on on their TikTok bio they'll say, oh, we have more on Instagram. Like, go to our Instagram, or right. they'll be like, oh, we have this many subscribers on YouTube. So that's what I did on our Instagram and our TikTok because we have less on there. So I was like, oh, we have a thousand on YouTube. Right. So no, go there. Sense. Yeah, smart. And it's just funny because it's, it's one, like not one, a ton, just one one thousand one k. <laughs> I mean, it's not nothing. Which is, yo, it's, it's not, not nothing. nothing. And it's the We're k not bad is at this. huge. The k changes everything. Dude. I was worried that the k wouldn't show up till like one point one. Right, but it's, right. It's there. That's all that matters. That is there, I'm dude. So it's excited. so legitimizing. Yeah. Like if you're on YouTube right now, mm-hmm. scroll down, mm-hmm. look. Mm-hmm. It says that 1K. looks better than it did. You probably don't remember. Yep. If you've been here a while. Aunt Boo Boo. Mm-hmm. You remember what it looked like. Yes. Looks different now. Aunt Boo Boo is giving you great Growing poop up. advice for yeah, your bowels. I need to I need to get on that Metamucil. You gotta talk to her. You gotta call Aunt Amazing, Boo-Boo. amazing home run solid advice. Mm-hmm. Yes. You know how I know? You know how? how I know? How do you know? Guess who has way worse poop issues than me and has ba- almost I think solved them? Probably not. I'm making that up. Mm. 
Who is who is who? Your who, entire family? Yes, my father. Ah, got it. My father has <laughs> the worst poop issues I've ever anybody I've ever met in my life, and I thought they were normal growing up. It's probably in just extreme IBS. It's got to be right. How, do you know how many times we've pulled over on the highway? Yeah, the to, highway from the shit. Does he bring his own like pack of 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 wipes or toilet paper or something? Or he's just he's not prepared. He's leafing. Oh, he's not. He's never for prepared. <laughs> <laughs> but but it happens. I've seen him like he'll grab like the he'll he'll get on the sideway and he'll grab the guardrail <laughs> and lean he, and lean so he doesn't shit in his own pants because he, he doesn't, doesn't take know him what, off. He knows what's coming and he has to he has <laughs> yeah. to brace himself. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's bad. Oh, that's really and so bad. that's that was gifted to me mm. genetically, right? Um, so I think Metamucil, it was Metamucil, wasn't it? Yes, so I think are, so. Yeah. So I, I wonder if I wonder if you, Aunt Boo Boo has had these issues. Maybe, maybe it's a Rinaldi thing. Maybe you Aunt Boo Boo might. If so, my heart goes out to you. Yeah, I wouldn't wish this on anybody. I would wish it on my worst enemy. <laughs> right, fuck him. Right, yes, but, um, but not you. Not you. Right, You're far from that. Aunt Boo Boo's yeah. having a party soon. Yes, yeah. Um, she's having like a a BBQ. A BBQ. That'd be, that's one, awesome. Uh, I should for, just go to it. For anyone interested, uh, the address is. Um, uh, I'm like I should just come back with you and go to it. Can he come to our? Bar- can Aaron come to the barbecue? Can I come to the barbecue? The family barbecue. Jenna's not going, which is like crazy. By the way, Jenna's my cousin. If you haven't, that'd be that's before. incredibly rude. I know. I would love We're to have a, a in person standoff about five seconds of summer. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. got my points, oh, and I have something for the end of the podcast. By the way, I just oh. remembered. I do have a okay. a, a final segment. Oh, okay. so stay tuned because Aaron's not going to like it. Oh, perfect. I, I'm not surprised I won't like it. Um, but because we're going to be doing before that party, before Aunt Booba's barbecue, yeah, we are, the day before we're doing the 999 yes. in Syracuse. And I'm very excited for that. So, for those who don't know, that's nine, nine hot dogs, yep. nine beers, yep. nine innings. Yes, sir. And it's sponsored. It it is. Are we allowed to announce that? Are we allowed to say that? Yeah, we're doing. We're well, well. Yeah, we're just doing it with the Mets, the Syracuse Mets. They're in. We're like the. We're gonna have a like, couple dogs with the. We're the, gonna have a couple dogs with. So my sister runs social the media producers? for them. We're gonna. We're gonna. It's not the owner. Not the owner. No. <laughs> That'd be awesome if we could get Crazy. the owner in on it. Um, or my sister's boss. I don't know what his title is, but he's gonna have a couple beers with us. And then we're just going to, ha- we're going to film there and hopefully we'll be able to like, you know, yeah. my sister will hopefully get us some camera time for the big screen. Yeah. We might get on the jumbo. That'd be awesome. If we get on the jumbo, we got to have, we got to be planned and ready of what we're going to do. Do we down a dog? Do we down a beer? What do I'm, we do? I am dancing. B. Yes. I put both. The, I put I the dog both. in the beer, I think chug we- the beer, <laughs> eat the dog. I think we Kobayashi it. We. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we Wait, race. Pack, pack. We race. We get on the if we get on the jumbotron, we're dipping our dog and <laughs> eating it, eating it like we're a yeah. food warrior. Yep, yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> so if you're in, if you're in Syracuse, yes, um, yeah. What's the date? It's the if you're in Syracuse, thirteenth, July nineteenth, the nineteenth, the nineteenth, so, the thirteenth. You're gonna be on vacation <laughs> with my okay. girlfriend. I love um, you. The nineteenth of July. If you're in Syracuse. Come to the game. It's a Friday. And if you want, you Friday can come night. have a beer and a dog with us. We'll you can be on the show because we'll be filming it. Yeah. Um and you can feed me. We might do yeah, we could feed you can feed, feed Lucas. Lucas. If I, you come to the game and you come to see us, you can feed Lucas. And I'll pretend I don't like it because it's so it's a little bit more fun for you. Yes. So <laughs> you can tie him up. We'll tie him up. We no. don't care. We'll buy some rope. We'll tie him up. I don't know how we'll get rope into the stadium, but we'll get it in there and then we'll tie up Lucas. Um <laughs> Yeah, he please can't come back. leave until he finishes the nine beers. I, and nine I haven't drank that much in a long time, and I'm very nervous. What's your strategy going in? Do you have one for, uh, based on what happened last time? Yeah, I'm gonna front load on on dogs. Really? I was gonna do the opposite. I was gonna front load on beer, dude. You're gonna get trash. You're well, gonna get yeah, trash. Yeah, because then I'm gonna get more hungry. Well, no, that's what I'm saying. I think I think it's I think it's dogs mm-hmm. with a, with a beer. Okay. Then you go like three beers. Okay. And then you go dog beer, dog beer, then finish out you with do, beers. Then you do uh, together? Well, see, here's the thing. You, you get hungry, but you, you can also put... When I'm drunk, I can put away beers like nobody's business. That's true. That's my that's my thought. But, uh, yeah, yeah, I guess you're right. But I don't want to be too drunk. I don't want to be like... And I'm going to be. I don't know why... Like, I'm starting, off, beers is nine I'm starting beers. off with like 
three dogs, I guess, then in like, I can, I can down three dogs in five minutes. I think we do three dogs right from the get go. We come in hot and then we have, then we have two beers. Hot, hot. Yeah. We have to trick our brains to believing that we're never done eating. Mm. The minute my stomach is like, feels like a little full, I could push a tiny bit, but I'm done. I have to keep go. I have to keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need. I I think I think that is key. When I've overeaten, it's I've mm-hmm. eaten too much too quickly. Yeah, or for too long. You know. Right. I think the beer is going to help because we'll be able to burp and make more room. <laughs> and that's just how science works. <laughs> that's science. That's just it's, science. It, it eats space. It right. gets rid of it. It creates space. Right. That wasn't there before. Exactly. So the like the dogs go into the ether. I yeah. I plan on that's just nice. being full. Of dog, full of dog and beer. But I really think that, I don't know, man. I really think going some beer first might be. Dude, I'm if you're around and you would like to, we might do a celeb shot. Yeah, we'll do celeb shots. Like we maybe, like we get maybe one each. I'll sign your moobs. It's man boobs. I'm aware what they are. I'm assuming someone there will have them. Probably so Maybe. Me. <laughs> but yeah, you could say. Oh my God! What's so? I, what's what's our punishment if we don't do it? Well, I'm doing it. No, I mean I'm gonna do it too. I'm gonna do it. What if we don't? Then you have to get the cat. What happens? Um, you have to get the cat that you promised that me that you would get at a thousand subscribers. Are you disqualified if you throw up? No, no, because if you throw up and finish, I think that's extra points. It's extra points. I, I don't think, think so. so. No. Extra points if you throw up because that's not down. That's not keeping it down. Yeah, but like how grossed out are you going to feel once you've thrown up? Yeah, I'm not going to want to continue. That's what I'm saying. Like you got to keep but, it down. But that's what I'm saying. If if you continue after you throw up, that's so hard. That's gr- that's that's way that's way hard. I'm sorry. Throwing up and then eating many hot dogs and drinking a lot of beer yeah. is triumphant. God. That that is the underdog story. I'm, Are you kidding yeah, me? That's yeah. like being down by nine in the eighth inning and coming back to win it all. I uh, yeah. I'm not encouraging throwing up. However, I do stretch. think respect respect where respect is due. Yeah, I want to have going in a schedule. <laughs> You're gonna plan an itinerary for your dogs and beer for for us for like every inning something we have to do or like like the seventh Ooh. inning stretch we gotta like we I have like a that. minute where we just go hard we try to get as much down as we can yeah um something like that okay or like um like, like, or like a dance one of us has to like do a lap around the stadium yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, they have to chug a beer and do a lap around the stadium. <laughs> something like that where I it's like just that. we're we're causing chaos i'll do i'll do a lap easy yeah easy drunk lap you kidding lap me? is fine or okay here's an idea what we implement a wheel you love your wheels and if there's I, you can spin the wheel and maybe you get uh 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 oh ice cream you have to finish an ice cream no yeah. no 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 <laughs> yeah. no yeah. no yeah. that's yeah. not complicated <laughs> yeah. that's, yeah. i love wrinkles then i'm throwing i love up. throwing in then i love throwing up. in wrinkles I love throwing in wrinkles. Um, you must love old people. <laughs> old people. Um, or like, uh oh, jumbo dog. One of the dogs has to be a jump. <laughs> has to be a jumbo. That's funny. That's funny. <laughs> like one of, and it doesn't. It only counts as one. But it has yeah, to be it only a counts big one. as one. Yeah, it still only counts as one. It's a great line. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm in. I think more of them should be not adding more food and yeah. drink. I think it's okay. going to be so hard. I'm down for like maybe one. It is gonna be like fair, there's like right? one sliver. It's like jumbo dog. Yeah. Please Uh-oh, don't jumbo dog. Please don't jumbo dog. Please don't jumbo dog. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oops. Oh my god. Yeah, I think that'd be really fun to like possibly come in with some sort of I- ideas of what we could do besides the actual thing to keep it going because we'll like mic ourselves up and we'll like record ourselves. Um, which I'm thinking we could try your. Little clip mics that you bought, uh, dude. They kind of sound horrible. Okay, but I'm down to try it. If you want to try it, might as well try it. I mean, yeah, because we, we can't bring some this. sort of. Yeah, no, so. obviously we can't do that. But, but I can, I'm I can bring them. I can bring the lapel mics if we need. If we need them, but I will have to bring in my laptop and stuff. Okay, we, we can talk about it. We can we'll figure it out. We'll um, figure it out. But I'm excited for that. That's gonna be a great too. video. How many drinks is too many at your own wedding? I say a million. 
Go ahead. How many drinks is too many drinks at your own wedding? Yeah. Um, I, you know, I don't know. I feel like that's a teach to each their own thing. I would personally, I don't want to be too drunk at my wedding. You want to remember it. I'd like to remember it. I want to like be at a really good buzz the whole time. Mm. You know, I don't want to mm. be sick that night. I don't want, yeah, you know. Like like a like a four four buzz. Yeah, yeah, like a four or five. Yeah, yeah, constant. Right. Yeah, I think that's about right. I think it's about right. Mm-hmm. It's enough to like be having a really good time, but still be sober enough to know you're doing it. Right, yes. I, I think I want to avoid, avoid like beer. Oh, and just go classy. do like classy drinks. You're, so I'm sipping the whole right, time. Right. Yeah. And it's, it's taking me, it's slower. Cause if I'm having beer, like I'm going to drink like 20 of them at the, <laughs> at my, I swear to God, I will. <laughs> so yeah. I think it's about I'm right. Doing. I think that's why, why think do you, why right. do you ask? I saw something online that was like, um, there's certain amounts of drinks you can have based on what role you are. Oh. So like the, like the bride and groom can be about five deep. Okay. Um, most guests can go up to eight. Okay. Um, but like best man sticks at two or three because they have to be in control. Best oh. man. Uh, okay. Bridesmaid. Uh, or the maid of honor. Maid of honor. But but groomsmen and bridesmaids can match the bride and groom, but they cannot surpass. What what is this math that they were doing? I don't know. I don't know. What are you? I I think and, that and I'd, I I think if you're a bridesmaid or a groomsman, but not the best man or maid of honor, you can get sloshed. I think you. I think you should be. I think you, I think should, you should be get, because here's the thing. Yeah, I agree. I think that the bride and groom maybe should do like five, mm, five or six. Mm-hmm. That's a great thing. You're gonna remember it. You're having a good time. You got a great buzz. It's gonna be fun. You're dancing. The the uh, maid of honor and the best man are there to like if things get crazy they rein it back in that's right, their right, job. Right, 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 right. Everyone else's job is to make everyone else have a great party. Yeah, and they yeah. so they need it's to a be party. gone. A wedding is a party. Right. I'm sorry, they got to be the party ones. Somebody has to. You can't you can't rely yeah. on the people who are coming to the wedding as just the guests. Yeah. you can't rely on the guests. You have to have a talk with your crew beforehand. Yeah, you're. You're having ten tonight. You, know, <laughs> you got to call them out. You're ha- you're pushing twelve. If I, I need you to. Hey, okay? I know I know you can handle thirteen. Yeah, yeah. I want. Right. I, w- I just want that in the air. I want yes. that in the back of your head. I want five shots from you. All right, and you, I want you to pass out more to everyone. <laughs> Dude, that was um, that was this guy Jack at, at Ricky's wedding. Yeah, he was my guy. Was gone. My guy <laughs> was gone. Like he like he was like ended up unbuttoning all of his shirt. Oh, and then he had the 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 necktie hanging loose and like. His hair was ru- like he looked yeah. like if like somebody from a high school production like <laughs> like mocked somebody up to look like yeah. a drunk person. Oh my god! That's what he looked he's like. He's a caricature of a drunk person. He's a caricature. He's like <laughs> you know, like stumbling but having a great time. And then I saw him waiting for the train the next morning, yeah. like Amtrak to go up north. Yeah, and I'm like, hey Jack, how you doing? And he's like, what? <laughs> yeah. He's like, oh hey. Uh, Hey, great speech, man. Yeah. And I was like, yeah, I know. You told me, yeah. told me last night. He's like, uh, uh, yeah, right, yeah, I did. You know, <laughs> anyway, that's, I'll be seeing That's you. what you need. You need yeah. the party guy. You need the party guy. You do. Guy. I think everyone has their roles, but this this whole, like, they can match the bread. No, they got to go above and I beyond. think, be, yeah, I'm, I'm with you there. I'm with you there. We're here to have a good time. Mm-hmm. We're here to have a good time. Also, if, you're, if there's an open bar, which there should be. And there will be. If there's anyone who's not having an open bar, you're a cheapskate, and I don't want to go to your wedding. <laughs> The other thing is, no if there's doubt. an open bar, you better... I'm drinking. Yeah. I'm drinking. Dude. <laughs> I think I brought this up on the podcast re- like b- last year when I went to it. Like, yeah. When they were like, hey, the bar is turning into a cash bar in like five minutes. I've never seen people run to a bar faster. <laughs> they come back with three, four <laughs> drinks in their hands. Just me. That would be me. Yeah. That right. would be me. I, I have no fear of looking cheap. Oh, I have no fear. Neither do I. I'm, I'm always like. Neither do I. Using a coupon right here. Yeah. Oh, coupon. Yeah. <laughs> um, I will be couponing, or I'm gonna get all the drinks that I, I can. Are you gonna free. eat the wrapper cheese on that? I'll, I'd like to. eat I'll the ask my cheese. friends. I'll ask like you. Like, hey, like, are you gonna kind of a? Can I have a little bit. Of that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You're you're really good. I'm at a that. fiend. I'm a fiend. You, <laughs> you're really good at asking for like just a bite of. Just thing. ask. Yeah. Just ask. Why not? I am. I am really bad when it comes to that stuff, unless I'm at like 
places like that, like a wedding or something. Then right, like, that's different. Then you're I'm like first in line for the food. I don't care. You're gonna be. I'm a, eating. You're you are the gourmand. Right, I am a gourmand. My favorite actually. word. Do you know what a gourmand is? It's somebody who eats without um without uh. What's the, what is it? Oh, I'm, I can't think of this other word. It's somebody who know. eats without, um, they, they like to eat a lot. Yes, they like to eat a lot. But there's um, also, I learned this recently, I'm a gourmand when it comes to smells that I like. Oh. I like sweet, savory smells. Ooh, like a candle. Yes, like, well, like, a sea breeze. like I like vanilla. Oh, I, love I vanilla. don't love sea breeze. That's not a gourmand. It's like things that are based off food smells. Or oh, what I really like. Oh, right. Okay. Like, yeah. like a pie sitting in a window. Yes. The right. The smell would lift you up and draw and like right. float you towards right. the Right. And some people like uh like um like the sea breeze. They like that kind of thing. They like the smell of like an old book or like something like that. I love the smell of an old book. Yeah, right. So I love the smell of you're a new probably book. a different kind of uh, Mo- scent person. I love scents. I'm gross with scents. Have you ever noticed I will smell everything I eat before yeah. I eat it? Yeah, you have the milk smell. Well, I have the, I have the milk smell. I have the bacon smell. I have the mm. egg smell. I, yeah. Everything I eat, I go, yeah. Every time. Which worries me because you don't have the best schnoz when it comes to smelling things. Oh, I and have. And that's a fact. That's I a fact. I'm have sorry. an average snob, schnoz. <laughs> you have an acute schnoz. You, you, have a, you have a high sense of smell. Somebody who has this low yeah. sense of smell, somebody's like, somebody like Cole. Doesn't yeah. smell anything. Yeah, I'm a blood. It smells hound. very. You are. Put, I, I don't need to put my nose to the ground. I know where it is, dude. You, you, you have that like you have that genetic makeup. I'm telling you right now. It's something about being. You're Sicilian. Are you Sicilian or northern northern Italian? Sicilian. You're Sicilian. northern Italian. I'm southern, bitch. You are. Yeah. Where? I'm. I'm the ankle. I'm in the ankle. Oh, you're. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, I could be darker. I'm getting darker. Man, imagine if like we could just tan in the Mediterranean <clears throat> all day. <clears throat> I'd love so that. Nice. That would, that would be a lot of fun. Um, so I think I think with your genetic makeup, mm-hmm. um, there's a lot of smells yeah. that went into it, and it was be- genetically beneficial. Yeah, to smell. No, you're right. You even have a little bit of that. Like your nostrils are a little bit more exposed than most people's. Yeah, and I got a fat, thick nose. Yeah, and my bridge is like, look at this. Look at this. Look it's a lot. It's a lot of bridge. It's like the land bridge from Russia to Alaska. Oh yeah, the Bering Strait. Yes. No. Is that it? I think so. I think that's what the sea's called. Oh, I didn't know. Yeah, I had no idea. Um, speaking of the sea and tanning, we went to the beach. We went, we to, went to the beach. beach. We got rained on. Yeah, we went to Rockaway Beach. Uh, it was really nice. There was a. It was a beautiful day until it thundered. The skies opened up and rained on us. God, we luckily we weren't down. in the rain. No, we got out just in time, which yeah. was really nice. No, it was it was really nice. Besides. The water, which was disgusting. The water was so gross. So we gross. all swam in it, and I felt disgusting. It was like every. It was like if parts if parts per million ppm mm-hmm. of seaweed to water. It was yeah. um, they do it out of a million normally, right? And, and there was it was glass a, and glass. So it was um, a, a one million parts per million seaweed. <laughs> yeah, is what yep. is what the and it was dark. <laughs> and it was it was the water dark. Was dark. It was like East River, like. Off flow. Yeah. I mean, it was. I don't know if we were in a bad section or it was a bad day. Got my mouth. Oh no! Did it? It didn't get in your mouth. It got elsewhere. You swam under. You went in. In. Oh, I went in, in, and I rode the craziest you body. Did. Surf, that was awesome. Which Lucas was wild. had the body surf. It was insane. The stuff of legend. He was like Bethany Hamilton. It was nuts. Sure. Who? Yeah, Bethany. I was. I was. She's Bethany the girl that got up. the surfer that got her arm bit by the shark. Could have been Remember me. Remember her, Soul Surfer. You ever seen Soul Surfer? I remember the commercials. Very sad. Very sad. Triumphant story, though. (laughs) More triumphant than Meg. The Meg. The Meg. (laughs) Like like, much more. Like Megalodon. Yes. Um, Jason Statham. Yes. I'm. I'm not kidding. I was like. I must have gone 50, 60 feet. You went, it was crazy. So you sped past everybody. Yeah. I've never seen a body I went all like the way into the beach. Yeah. I went I, all the yeah. way. I got up and the water was like around my ankles. Yeah. It was insane. It, like no boogie board, just your body. It was nuts. Was this before or after you stabbed yourself in the foot? This was before. Yeah. And then I was, I got cocky. I started running. Yeah. Wonton. Yep. Great word, by the way. Yeah. I was running wonton through the water mm-hmm. and I, um, I stepped okay. on a shell. I felt it crack, and then it pierced 
My heel. Yeah, go ahead. I don't know. Talk about it. it pierced, and then Cassie had to do surgery on me later. She to did. Pull it she, out. Yeah, she did. She put a band aid on me. She put a band aid on me. <laughs> you were smart, though. You'd put sand in Just it and a little you rubbed it in. On it, I'm not kidding. That helped. Yeah. Weirdly enough, that helped. It stuffed it. You said, it not today, stuff. blood. <laughs> <laughs> stay, stay in. That's what happened. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Try me, blood. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what's up blood <laughs> got sand over oh my here. god yeah yeah and you you uh couldn't play frisbee with us no like i i you came... missed me eat shit i ate shit hard i know you did because i heard cassie laugh really hard next to me uh, while yeah, I was that's, lying that's down. what happened um she wouldn't miss that well, for either, the world yeah that's that was what happened i had my how were you, you okay yeah, I was fine. You okay? I just I wasn't prepared to catch the frisbee. We played frisbee. Oh, by the way, we played frisbee and I threw it. And it <laughs> <laughs> I threw it really hard and I, it was a bad throw and it went up and I was like, "Oh no." And it started to curve down and there were these two people sitting. And I was like, "That's past them. <laughs> that's not going to hit them." We that's were all so sure. Yeah, like, we oh, that's, so that's far past them. He came down and at the last second Cole was like, "Whoa." And it hit the chair of hard, the, uh, hard of hard. one of the guys sitting. He was, it was like a middle aged man. He was furious. He was so which angry. was honestly so refreshing. Most people are so nice about that type of thing. <laughs> like, I dude, like, I was honestly oh. so mad he didn't. It was like Cole that went over there because if I went over there, I was like gonna be like, okay, dude, like fuck off. I, I don't I w- care. I would have been like. Like, relax. It, w- it dude. was an accident. Yeah, he's like, I'm going to throw it out next time it happens. I <laughs> yeah. said, okay, I'll pick it up out of the trash. Yeah. What? I like, was, dude, you're at the beach. He was crazy. Yeah, you're in, at the beach. And he was in in the play area. I'm yeah. sorry. Back of the beach is the play area. Mm-hmm. Front of the beach is for chillaxing. Right. I wish I hadn't used that word. <laughs> but um, but, no, but, but it's true. But it's true. The back is where people play games. Yeah, back is for games. And he was in the games area. He was in the games area. He was in the... He was in the frisbee flight zone. I, I think that was his choice. He chose to do that. He chose to do and that. And then he's this he's the kind of person where if this was like a frisbee that landed in his yard, he'd be like, get off my property. Mm-hmm. Why are you in my property? Like he's the person that loves to say property. You ever notice that about like <laughs> 55, 60 year old yeah. men? All they of a sudden it's about their property. Like, yeah, their property. Like <laughs> it's about leave me alone and com- community is bad. Yeah, right. And I don't talk to my daughter anymore. Yes, they tell us immediately what side they would have been on in 1860. <laughs> immediately we know and they because yeah, I, don't, I don't know why don't they, they get it. so like prideful about it they're like oh their, their frisbee landed in my property i'm gonna fucking kill them they didn't pay for this property <laughs> it's a lot of uh, somehow it's about morals problems. it's about integrity yeah. in some way yeah they have a lot of issues yeah. with things being taken from them maybe i don't know it's about bottling it up and waiting for the first person to get near you yes he was yeah. he was mad he was there alone with his wife i don't know what happened but he was furious now i get it if i was hit by a frisbee i'd be a little pissed but i'm also not gonna say anything about it but this was like a i, I feel like he was like a he, brooklyn guy he was know? a broken guy and i i'll say it i think those are the people that should be bullied more than anybody <laughs> else in the world because if if you're gonna have that short of a temper you're gonna make <laughs> yourself that miserable at 60 yeah. it's too late for you yeah <laughs> it's too late for you but i don't think you're gonna change so i'm i'm gonna make you mad and i'm gonna laugh yeah that's hilarious i thought he was gonna like throw it i or just like I, I would just like be like oh it's fine i'd throw it back to them yeah that's what i would that's what i would have done that's, I that's, that's what i would have done because i'm i'm not um a, a grumpity old man I don't, it's a, a different word it was a different grumpity word grumpity sounds like that. a fun a fun word but i i grumpity, part of me hopes grumpity. he would be like the type of guy where you'd say hey dude you're acting like uh like, like a grumpy old man and he'd go what how did this happen? How did I become the grumpy old if man? If somebody said that to me, I would reevaluate my life immediately. <laughs> yeah, right. I'd be like, yeah. I'm what? Am I really? Yeah, I'm what? Grumpy old man. Like, that's yeah. like the worst thing to be. I agree. It would as, it, a, yeah. as a child, it's the worst thing to be. Oh, for sure. And even as an old man, it's like the worst thing to be. You don't want to be the well, grumpy old man. You want to be the old that's man the thing. that's fun. As an old man, you still think you're a kid. Right. You know, old old people always say, I, I feel like I'm 22 in my head. Mm-hmm. You're okay, not, act like not. it. You're old. Act like it. Yeah. Don't act like an asshole. Yeah, go do a sprint down the beach. Show Bitch. me. Show me. Go long, Gramps. Go long. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I would have loved to say that. To him. I would have loved to say that to him. Yeah, fucking go long, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be great. He would look at you and be like, okay. 
<laughs> I feel like he'd he, be he, so defeated because he, like, he couldn't. He was probably like an old, like an ex cop. <laughs> He's probably like, you know, I, I fucking brought in hundreds of perps. And I would have been like, yeah, I have a music degree. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to fucking do about it? Huh? What are you going to do about it? Spell out a spell out a four major seven chord, bitch. What's the key? I didn't hear you ask. Interesting. You would need to know that. You would need to know that. <laughs> Idiot. That's so funny. I got to bring up the JT. Please do, please do, because this is we got to talk. Yeah, we have to talk about JT. Uh, I know this was a little bit ago, like a week, two weeks ago. Um, JT was arrested for a DWI. And first off, if you haven't seen his uh, mugshot, I'll it's put it up. It's so good. It's hysterical. It's so good. I, there is no one behind those eyes. No. he. It's the most glassy-eyed person I've ever seen. He looks like a doll, like a wax figure of himself. And <laughs> it's it's hysterical. It's so funny. Um, his eyes read, bye, 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 but his soul is gone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yep, that's exactly right. Yeah. And I'm obviously... He should have been arrested. He you can't be doing that. He you was can't drive drunk. in the wrong. Can't drive drunk. People die from that all the time. So can't be doing that. Um, you know he pulled a, do you know who I am? He bit. did. No, he did. Did he? Did and, he actually? And the officer didn't know who he was. <laughs> the officer Beautiful. was like our age, Good. apparently, and didn't know who he was. Oh, even better. And even better. He was like, this is going to ruin the tour. And the officer's like, what tour? <laughs> and he goes, the world tour. <laughs> Okay, Justin. I've been seeing so many memes with that that specific the world progression. Tour. Yeah, <laughs> you're gonna, this is gonna ruin the tour. What tour? The world tour. <laughs> Did you see they asked Billy Joel about it? Yeah, yeah. yeah they asked so Billy funny. Joel. They just found him sitting bet, eating lunch. He was like, he was like I, "I don't really, have, I don't really know the guy." Yeah, uh, I don't, no comment. Yeah, no like, comment. I don't know the guy. He was mad. He was God, like, Billy Why did Joel, you ask of all me? people, be the last person to ask about anything pop culture. Yeah. He doesn't know anyone. He doesn't need to. He was pop culture. Right. Leave him alone. He, he doesn't need he to. He did his piece. Right. He did his bit. He wrote Uptown Girl. He doesn't have to do anything else. And he never once got arrested for drunk driving. That we know of. That we know of. True. That we know of. That we know of. He might have. Well, he was too busy eating in an Italian restaurant. He didn't have time. Didn't have time. Bottle of, bottle of red. Bottle of red. Yeah, that's a banger. Um, but yeah, so <laughs> the funniest part of this was his response. Was JT's statement? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that he put out. And yeah. I'm gonna read it to you because Please I don't want to do. botch it. Please, because it's hysterical. Um, I believe it was uh, these guys posted it. Bottle white. Here it is. <laughs> now there was a longer version, but this is uh, this is the best quote. It's been a tough week. I know sometimes I'm hard to love, but you keep loving me right back. <laughs> and I love you. <laughs> That's fake. That sounds so fake. I know I'm hard. I know I'm hard to love, but you you keep, but you keep loving me. And I love you right back. There's no apology. That's crazy. There's that was, no apology. No apology. It's he's, been a tough week. He's he not sorry. Yeah. No, he's not. It was tough because he got caught. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm sorry, JT. That was bad. That was you. It was so bad, bad dude. boy. I'm bad. Like, he's he's a bad boy. It's so funny because he's so right. He is hard to love. Yeah. That was. I feel. And I you, felt like you, a parent. You do keep loving him, don't you? Yeah. I, I'm. I feel like a parent whose kid is like he, a delinquent and keeps like getting brought home by the cops. <laughs> and you're like, what are you doing? Stop fucking up. You know what? And and here's the thing. Um. That's what you have. Mm-hmm. And you can, you're allowed to keep loving him. Mm -hmm. I have Drake Bell. You have Drake Bell, and I, I had to, I had to sell my son out. I had to be like he's you no. I, I had to say you're no son of mine. Yeah, no son. Of, you're disowned. You were. I had to disown my son. You you still have a chance with your son. He's gonna keep fucking up. He's gonna keep fucking up. We have a chance. You have, my, you have an easier one. Mine's easier because mm -hmm. I don't keep getting hurt. Yeah, but the this, hurt's already been done fully. I just keep getting hurt. But mine's never going away. I'm, I can't keep defending you. <laughs> I can't keep defending you if you keep being a piece of shit. I can't do it. Yeah. 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 
You know, a video I love, and I, I've talked about this before, is a video of when he got punked. <laughs> that dude, dude, that that showed us exactly who he was from that, that moment. That was who I've he never is. seen someone and more furious of like, I'm a pop star. How dare you? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. He was. It was so privileged. <laughs> Even Ashton's like, yeah. <laughs> Ashton was like, uh, should we cut this? <laughs> like, uh, should we, what should we it do? was a joke. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and he tries so hard when he finds out. He's like, yeah, man, it's so funny. <sighs> yeah, he's so, he's he's so furious. <laughs> Yeah, I know, like, I the more I, like, have gotten, you know, aged and, like, understand how, like, crazy he is, I don't think I ever want to meet him. No, no, no. This is a hero you do not yeah, want to meet. This, is a, this would uh, be a bad time. Yes. This would be, oh, it'd be a horrible. Very bad time. Yeah. I do have this, like, dream of interviewing him one day, mm-hmm. one-on-one, asking him be, questions, but, like, I make it that. funny. And, yeah, like, yeah. I would have a much. million questions. Justin, come Justin, on. come on. Yeah, first interview Fix your since, name. <laughs> first interview since. We can set EWI. your name straight. God, that would skyrocket us to fame. Yes. We would imme- we'd be set for life immediately. And I would love it. So basically what you want to do, um, you need to you need to think of a card, like a card in a deck. Okay. But you gotta you gotta like you gotta like you're gonna hit me. I'm not gonna hit you. You're gonna, you're gonna hit me. I'm not gonna hit you. Okay. You promise you're not gonna hit I'll me. I'll pinky promise you. That's, Don't hit and me. that's a brother's bond. Okay. Um. So you gotta sit here, and think really hard, but you gotta make a face like, what? like it's so hard to I, think. I, I don't want to do that. It's gonna hurt me. No. Well, don't do okay, it. I'll don't think, hurt yourself. Really hard. It, it. It. You have it in your head. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to think of a card. Yeah. yeah. Just, no, that's the, the whole point. I was acting. I was doing the face. I was really oh, the well done. Think of a card. You got a card in your head. Yes. You thinking of it? Mm-hmm. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, ready? <laughs> <laughs> Lucas bought a fart machine. I bought a fart machine. <laughs> you're going to have to add them in after. There's no way they heard that. They might have. This picks up the room pretty well in okay. certain spots. Okay. Yeah, so Aaron, are you feeling all right? <laughs> no, actually, my tummy has been like, I've been farting all day. So <laughs> it could have been real. I don't, I don't know. I'm not sure. <laughs> so that was that was surprise number one. <laughs> uh, fart machine. That's awesome. That is the best. You should just leave it back there. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Well, For later tonight. And then just. Oh, know, yeah. D- randomly. Whenever anybody's. <laughs> Do you get to pick which one it is or it's random? It's random. Uh, Want to try? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> that's incredible God, that's this. so fun we should just use this in public yes we should we should get people. put it in your back oh, pocket for the july when we go out with the shirts <laughs> wait, wait 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 ready I'll, I'll, i'm gonna ready yeah this is what i'm gonna do okay what is he doing okay <laughs> yeah 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 Oh shit. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> you got to do that. That will do that. That's amazing. Got to bring it. Oh my god, that's awesome. The fart machine is one of the, I'm sorry, it's just universally funny. If you're a farts guy, especially farts are funny. Farts man. are funny. I don't know how, exactly how Who? much farts funny. are funny in the in the women community, but it's if you're a guy, farts are fun. I think the fart is the original joke. It's the first joke is a fart. Yeah. Mm-hmm. First, I think the first person laughed, the first thing that the first person laughed at was a fart. Yeah. It's that's a hilarious. funny sound. You're, Give Put the smell out of it. It's a funny sound. Your butt makes a little toot noise like a uh-huh. trumpet. That's are you what, kidding yeah, that's me? That's why it's called a toot. Mm-hmm. Yep. Wonderful. What, yeah, it's how you play the trumpet. The trumpet. Uh, do you think Mambo can... number five. Mambo number five. What a crazy song. It's good. It's just about a guy running through women. <laughs> it's nuts. It's crazy. I'm sorry. It's it good. blows my mind. It's good. It, no, it's a great song. Well, it's a no, catchy as fuck song. And that means it's great yeah. in my opinion. In my opinion. No, you're right. You're right. You're right. Because a great song can be great for many, many a reason. And catchy is one of them. That's true. Vibe. A song can be great because just because it has a good vibe. So the same thing for melody. Same thing for tones. 
Same thing. Whoa. Wow. It's vodka. What a good pot. <laughs> I, oh, I was stuck in an elevator. Yeah, that's crazy. What are you doing with that? Just holding it. No, you're not. Can you close your eyes? No. <laughs> no. You're going to hit me. I'm just going to hold it. Um. Yeah, I got stuck in an elevator for a hot second at my storage unit. That was fun. It just like wouldn't open. So and it wouldn't move. It wouldn't go down or up. It dude, that just, is so scary. That open. is the most terrifying I like, like, thing I can imagine. All right. How many floors? I immediately it? established a P corner. <laughs> <laughs> Southwest corner. Yeah, I did not establish P corner. Um, they were actually very helpful. I like called down on the intercom and they were like, yeah, <laughs> what What do you want? It's like, uh, I'm stuck in the elevator. <laughs> can, you, can you get me out? And they're like, oh, yeah, okay, we'll be right there. It oh. took them like f- 10 minutes. How did they do it? What did they do? I don't know. They just had a key and they turned it and then it worked apparently i don't fucking know i was in the elevator i didn't see what they were doing that's dumb so is I that didn't. easy there should be a button for that there should be an emergency stuck in the elevator if there's a key to fix it yeah there should be like oh i'm stuck that's dumb it's very dumb but yeah that would, i made but it out, that that I made freaked it out me alive out. i would think about like going up through the hatch that'd be my first thought how do i get out yes i'm going up through the hatch in the top and i'm really? jumping your, like your anakin skywalker is, is how do i get out okay my thought was, how long am I going to be in here? Um, that was my first thought. And there was no cell service. Oh, shit. So I'm just, all I can do is talk to the people through the intercom. They're like, hey, you still there? Like, yeah. <laughs> Where would I have gone? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I you didn't leave, did you? I'm not like Dr. Strange. I can't make myself a portal out of here. <laughs> but yeah, I'm still here. Um, hey. What? Well, you going to come help? Did you want us to... Are you good in there? Do you want to just? Did you? Did, are you requesting help? Because I needed. I need a verbal confirmation. <laughs> I need a verbal confirmation from you. Oh, did you see fucking Fantano's new video? No, that pissed me off to high hell. <laughs> what do you say? He's 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 like these are the most disappointing albums of this year, and it's like every album that's come out. <laughs> it's like every album that's come out this year is like this one, uh, zero musical talent, like blah blah blah. It's horrible. Was it just pop music? It was mainly pop music, yeah. It was, you, it was, was JT's, Ariana's, um, this new Gracie Abrams one. Damn. Um, I forgot what else he had on there. But it was like, it was every album that's come out this year. He's like, this was disappointing. What? And I was like, Fantano, you just are the worst. Why was he you so excited? make me angry. Why was he excited for JT? Like, he's a JT fan. <laughs> yeah, what is, Fuck off. Why was he excited for, for also... What's disappointing about JT for why, him? It feels like he like has five albums in his head that are the best of all time and everything else will suck compared to yes this. he is he is like he is a music nerd to mm-hmm. the truest extent where he is like totally up his ass a little bit about yep. stuff and he'll say he's oh well no i like i like all genres of music but no, clearly he, no. he has preference just like anybody else he clearly has preference he loves his rap music he love yeah he loves his cool rap music. yeah yeah yeah, yeah. He, and he loves his Dub- l w anything w- noisy l L, L, <laughs> W, L. <laughs> hey, it fucking pisses me off, dude. He'll just like... <laughs> Is that what he does? Yeah, he'll like do... Someone will like go through their like top 10 albums. They'll post a video on TikTok and he'll be like, let's see how they did. L, this album's L, W, that's a good one. And it, that's... that's That sounds annoying. And then he gets way more views than that original video did. <laughs> that's kind of fucked up. He's the worst. He's the worst. Tony Fantano. I used to be a big fan and then I realized that... Um, he can be really he's frustrating. Just, he's he's so just another he just, music reviewer. All he does, and I get it, he just says things to piss people off so that they comment and they boost his videos. Yeah. But it's still just, ugh, yeah. it annoys me. He does have some good takes where I'm like, okay. Yeah, everyone has some good takes. But I, I think on the whole, I just disagree with him. Mm-hmm. Like, he's this thing where, like, music isn't good unless it's innovative. Right. And I'm like, wrong. That's just wrong. Wrong. Next. Yeah. Next opinion. Thank you, next. I don't even know what this um, is. I don't I've, know what anything is. I have a challenge for you. Uh, you might have done this before. They're very easy to get your hands on. Um, I want you to eat this thing. No. Is it the hot chip? No. Okay, thank God. I feel like it's going to be worse. It might be. I think for you, yes. Is this a bug? I don't want to eat a bug. No! Crickets. No! Ugh. Sour cream and onion. I don't want to do this. I think you have to do one. No. I think you have to. Why? For the, for the podcast. Why do I have to do one? We hit a thousand subscribers. We have to do something. 
I, Aaron, I spent my hard-earned money on this. No, on this what crickets. do you mean your hard-earned money? I, I, I work every day. Let me see these. Ew, dude. Oh, that's so gross. Are you grossed out because their eyes are still in? Their eyes are still in? Why'd you tell me that? Because I think you should eat it. What about you? I'll have some, yeah. I have at least one. I've had them before, What? but are not they, this flavor. Are they good? They're fine. They taste like peanuts. They're just oh, crunchy. No, dude. No. I think you have to. I don't want to, though. I think just one. Ew, dude. I think if you just... <laughs> oh, these are... No. Aaron, I spent money on this for you. I don't care what you spent money on. You're going to make me feel bad like that? I think you, I think you have to. Tr- I think you have to. What do you mean? I, I don't have to do anything. <laughs> I don't know what you're going to do if you don't. I'll just say I didn't want to. Do you want me to do one first? I'll go first. Show you, show you it's not going to hurt you. Dude, this is terrifying. <laughs> do people actually eat these? Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. They're like a big, um, I think in the East, they eat a lot of bugs, a lot of crickets. What the There's fuck? nutrition facts and everything. You know, how many, Do you know how many calories one cricket is? 4.3. <laughs> Right on the back here, nutrition facts, 4.3. <laughs> that means they burned up a cricket alive. So they find that out, by the way. Calories, they burn something in a vacuum see, to see how long it burns. Somehow that Rump, translates. drumstick, flank, breast, and wings. They don't have all that. <laughs> <laughs> this is a one bite. They didn't thing. mention why the head. They, yeah, why are they acting? They didn't mention the fucking eyeballs. Where are they getting all these crickets? Dude, there's lots of them out there. You you think you're contemplating? Yeah, I'm, I don't want to. They got a lot of protein though. Do they really? 0.67 grams. Oh my god! But for a one gram bug, wait, wait, wait there's one gram. What am I talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. oh yeah, yeah. So each. They are 67% protein. Ugh. That's really good. Per calorie, it's not bad. Here they are. Ooh. One of their legs fell off. Yeah. Chicken wing. I don't I just I don't want to get cricket stuck in my teeth. You know, I don't want to have cricket teeth. They get some floss. These just dry, like it's, uh, they taste like, like chips. Peanuts? They're like chips. Yeah, they do taste no, like they're, they're like chips. Oh, they're like chips. They're sour cream and onion. Are you going to have one right now? Let's, we're both going to have one right now. Oh my God. All right, go ahead. Yeah? Go ahead. Okay. You eat one first. Oh yeah, I'm going first. But like I said earlier, I have to smell it. Ew. Um, doesn't oh, smell like dude. sour cream and onion, that's for sure. Oh, here's one. I guess I'll eat this guy. Oh, man. He's ew. missing some legs, though. Ew, dude. Ew, ew. Oh, no. Uh, you don't lick it. <laughs> You're doing a lick test. Doesn't taste like sour cream. And oh, onion. dude. No, what was that? What was that face you just made? No, what fine. was that? No, it's easy. no, what was that? What part was that for? They're crunchy. A little crunchier than I'd like it. Hmm. Oh, wash it down. I don't want to do this, man. Wash it down. No, it's dude, it's fine. You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be, you don't want you you won't even you I don't won't like even notice the, it. I gave you a beer and you're giving me a cricket. <laughs> Think about that for a minute. Sounds like a fair trade to me. They're just, they're the only thing I'll say is they're a little dry. They're a little dry. That's the worst. They're, dude, they're flavored. No, you just said they don't taste like sour cream. You'll like it. You love sour cream and onion. Ew, dude. It's a whole animal. This, This is what God wanted. No waste. I don't want to do this. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. Woo woo. Ew. <laughs> oh. Yeah, baby. That tastes disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Explain it. What note, are you getting any notes of like maybe rosemary or? It tastes like eating the outside of a peanut shell. Yeah, it's about right. It's about right. Oh, it's coming to life. Oh, it's coming to life inside me. Are you calling it back? <laughs> chirp, chirp. Dude, that's gross. Yeah, I didn't like it. It also thought it was gross. I'm hiccuping. Um, I don't recommend. That was disgusting. Do you want to guess where I got them? The bodega. Macy's. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, what is happening at Macy's? <laughs> what is going on in I'm, Macy's? Dude, I'm so proud of you. I didn't think you would do it. I didn't think you'd you do it. You forced me. I did force you to do you it. Forced force you forced me. It's on the pod. It. it is on the pod. Um, if anyone would like them, uh, they will not be eaten. Um, so I'm saying it right know. now. I'm going to demolish the 999. <laughs> <laughs> For eating a cricket? If you can eat a cricket, I think you can do the 999. I'm so proud. Yeah. Aaron, you've come a long way. Thank you. The old Aaron would not have had a cricket. No, I would not have. I still was about to not do that. If we weren't doing the pot, I would have not. I know. I know. You would never have. You would never have. Oh, all right. You did I great. ate a cricket. You did great. He did great. Everyone can go ha have a cricket. Everyone, let, let him know in the comments how great he did. Oh, cricket in my teeth. I think it's a leg. Yeah, probably. I got something stuck in the back. Oh. Doing a cold. Oh. Oh. But yeah, um, we're going to crush the 999. We are. Um, um, we're going to do a pod right before, aren't we? Or no, because you'll be home. No, no, no. We'll, we'll do, do another one next that week. That will be our pod for that week. Right, right, right. right. That's not next week, I'm, is it? No, I'm it's the week this. after. No, don't. I'm not. I don't need to burp. You need to burp. All right. That's all we got for today. Thank you so much for listening. Thank you for a thousand subscribers. It really means a lot. We will see you next week.